That's what all of us need to do. We need to talk about this to folks that we meet that are on the, the fence, or even perhaps on the other side. And we have to be out there convincing more and more people to take a strong stand. Because obviously, our voices are not being heard in Ottawa. The Cairo stands with First Nations in opposing the Gateway Pipeline. In fact, we stand opposed to any pipeline. Over 130 First Nations groups have signed the Fraser Declaration, which says, we will not allow the proposed Enbridge Northern Gateway Pipeline or similar tar sands projects to cross our lands, territories, and watersheds, or the ocean migration routes of Fraser River Salmon. We are adamant and resolved in this declaration, made according to our indigenous laws and authority. We call on all who would place our lands and waters at risk. We have suffered enough. We will protect our watersheds and we will not tolerate this great threat to us all and to all future generations. Uh, if you Google um, uh, oil spills, you get 16 pages of them. I can, I can show you every one. Five major ones in Canada and if you Google the 10 worst ones in the United States, eight of the 10 were from tankers colliding. A really important point that has to be made is that it's not an oil pipeline, it's a bitumen pipeline. And bitumen is like tar, but it's worse than tar. It's filled with acids and, and sand, and uh, all kinds of pollutants and inside a pipeline it has to be heated to 20 degrees celsius and mixed with one-third condensate which is imported from asia in order to get it piped through that pipeline and the the abrasives in the bitumen wear down the insides of those pipelines i talked to an expert that worked in alberta and, and he told me, as a whistleblower, what really happens inside those pipelines. And he says that after a few years, you can almost look through them, they get so thin. And I think you are seeing the frustration that we go through. <clears throat> you know, it's years of fighting for our environment. Every time we try to fight for our rights to protect the environment they change the laws to suit them it's always been like that when our people first came to this land we obeyed the laws of the land and when the other people came here we had to obey their laws so where is the justice who is to protect the land so i think I appreciate all the people here. The Mama, they're playing with our future. They're trying to sell our country out through the pipeline. Mama, they're playing with our future. They're trying to sell our country out through the pipeline. Mama, they're playing with our future. They're trying to sell our country out through the pipeline. Bye.